Father God, thank you for this wonderful, wonderful day of church, God, and such a powerful message. And uh, it was it hit, it hit home so well. And thank you for um, for putting the pieces together so I can be so I can attend church today. Um, and also thank you for the baptisms that that occurred today. And I was not, I, to be honest, God, I was, I was expecting just. I mean, Anthony, I'm so glad that Anthony got baptized. My friend Anthony got baptized. It's been a long time coming. But I was blown away by my other friends, God. By my other friends in Christ, God. And that they got baptized too. And uh, especially my brother Saul, God. You're using both of them. All, you're using all of these people who are getting, who got baptized, God. For to build up your army until your kingdom to glorify you and to rise up your army and kingdom, God. <sighs> Thank you, God. And, and I pray that, that you continue to to um, to mold them, to continue to use them, and that um, they continue to build them up and to guide them to the next steps, God. And, uh, yeah. Um, <laughs> let you let your honor and glory shine through these people, God. Everywhere that they go, and um, and as for me, God, and and as for me, Lord, and I pray that uh, well, Lord, uh, I'm. It is, you know, and I pray that well, there's idols that <laughs> there's idols that I've made through through this time through throughout this past week. I pray that all well, these hidden sins and hidden idols that that this world has put up upon me, I pray that that be broken, God. And, Pray that it be broken in Jesus' name. Also, as for my financial issues, and um, gotta help me, gotta help me to be more responsible, not just in my finances, but for everywhere, for everything, to be more mature. To be more attentive to my finances, to be more responsible, like uh, make it simple as uh, making my bed and all that stuff, and to honor my parents, and um, every decision that I've made, every bad decision that I've made this past week. God help me to to be more mature and to. <laughs> to be more responsible I don't want to be I don't want to feel shame anymore I don't want to feel shame anymore and uh, I don't want to feel shame and uh, I don't want to be a failure I don't want to be a burden. I don't. I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to be a failure. I don't. I don't want to keep meeting the. I don't want to fail to meet the expectations of others. But I want. I want to be more responsible. I know easier said than done. I know it's a it's a mindset. It's a change in a mindset, and you know I shouldn't beat myself up. 
that these mistakes happen, these things happen. And I don't want to make it about myself either. And I don't want to make it about myself either. And God, and I know I, I know I encourage other people and lift them up and give them heartfelt hugs and and warm hugs and all that stuff. But help me to help me to hug myself sometimes. <laughs> help me to encourage myself. I'm a wreck. I'm a wretched wreck. I'm such a wretched wreck. I'm going to encourage myself. I'm going to be more mature and uh, more responsible. I can't, I don't, I can't do this adulting thing. It's so hard. This adulting thing is hard. Keep procrastinating. I don't think I can do it. I mean, I can, but I keep procrastinating. I don't even have my license. I'm going to be 33 in two months. What's wrong with me? Why can't I get it together? Why can't I get it together? Help me, God. Just help me to... <sighs> encourage myself. Help me to be more mature. Help me to be more financially responsible. Uh, help me to meet the needs of others, but at the same time, take. But at the same time, meet the meet me. At the same time, try to take care of myself as well. This adulting thing is very, very hard. Getting my license and getting my life together and getting, finding a place to stay and finding a girlfriend, a wife, whatever. It's hard. It's, it's, it's hard. I feel like the more I get older, the more responsibilities I have, and the more harder it gets. It's so, so hard. It's so difficult. This adulting thing is so hard, God. I can't take it. I can't handle it. I can't, but it's, I don't know. I know you're showing me signs that I gotta get my license, but I don't know, I keep procrastinating and I don't keep waiting till the last minute. And what if I fail? It's not about, like, what if, like, I can't grasp the knowledge of reading the, the book, the DMV thing, book thing. 
What if I forget? What if, what if I fail? What if I, I don't want to waste money to do it again. I don't want to put my family through that again. Uh, I don't want to be a burden to my family. Help me to get better. I can't do this on my own. I can't do this on my own, Lord. I need your guidance. Mm. <sighs> help me, God. Uh, help me, help me, Lord, help me. Can't do this on my own. Uh, guide me to my next step. So, what I let your will be done. And even if everybody's, even if everybody's growing and ahead of, even if everybody's growing spiritually. And through life, like help me to help me to keep help me to progress in help me to progress at at my own at your pace, God. Not mine. Help me to progress through life in your in your timing and your pace, God. Not mine. It's not of my parents. Time, not on my parents' pace, not on my family's pace, not in, not in society's pace, but in your pace. Oh my God! Oh my God! In Jesus' name. Amen.